Where's your old lady? Where's your old lady? Huh? Stay down, brother. Had enough? Should have new shit Dude, later. Stop thank by. God. Ricky, what's wrong? Do you know a man named Joshua Harper? Harp? Uh, yeah, yeah, I know him. I never trusted the son of a bitch. He uh, wrapped a black bandana around his head like he was pff, some goddamn hipster or something. Yeah, well, your instincts are pretty spot on. He shot Dan Lane in the back over a card game and took off. Oh, Jesus, where is he now? A patrol spotted him heading south. They were too scared to even approach him. I guess he'd met up with a group of drifters. I really need your help on this one. Okay, uh, I'll handle it. I marked where they spotted him on your map. Thanks, Deke. Oh, Ricky, looks like Harp and his men are heading to Camp Creek. Oh, gunshots. Okay, you can handle this? What do you think? Just ask him. Boss Lake out. Do this the easy way? Oh, shit. Go on, fellas. You're going to do my work for me. Don't let me stop you. Dig, did you find him? Uh, yeah. I hear gunshots. No, well, yeah, there's a uh, swarm. It, it, it kind of got to him before I did. Jesus. Well, bring back his headscarf. Dan's people want proof that Harper is dead. Yeah, okay, well, it, it might be a little bit messy. Fine. All right, sure, yes. Dude, it was way over there. Hey, got it. Oh, Jesus, what a mess. Okay, head back and talk to Ricky. Get my credits updated. Hey, Ricky, uh, here's Tarp's bandana. What a mess. Yep, that's what I said. Thanks, Deke. I'll let Dan's people know. St. John, this is Lost Lake. Come in. Yeah, Mike. This is Deke. I heard you tracked down Hart. I was hoping you'd bring him in for trial. Well, sorry, Mike. He, uh, le let's say the Swarmers had other ideas about that. Oh, shit. Ricky didn't tell me that. Or wasn't the kind of man you turned your back to, but he did deserve a lot like that. Uh, I guess not, uh, but then I guess Dan Lane didn't deserve to get shot in the back either. See you, Deke. Clear Mike out. Here we go. Oh, that'll do it. Blade. Where am I gonna find a blade? Wait, 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 what, what was that? The sporting goods store? Okay, let's see. What's going on here? You're mine now. Gotcha. Here we go. Hey. Hey. I got those parts that you were asked for. Oh, great. Well, uh, check back in a few. I'll see what I can do, yep. Uh, Ricky. Thanks. Yeah, Boozer's one of us now. Hey, Deke, you there? I've got Boozer's new prosthetic ready. I asked Addy to find him and send him over. Uh, great.
Great. Great, Ricky. I'll, I'll be right there. Deacon out. Just right in the okay. crease there. Okay. Got it. Let me secure it in, okay? There you go. That's better. Okay. Hey, brother. Look what oh. Ricky did. What? Made me a new toy. Oh, well, I was all Deacon. <laughs> oh, that's he really, really cool, Boozer. Hey, uh, I could have been one of those, those yeah. three goddamn musketeers. Hungard, oh, you fucking <laughs> ripper. Right. Pretty cool. Oh, hey. Jesus. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, well, maybe this hey. wasn't that good of an idea? Yeah, maybe. Damn it. Okay. St. John, you there? It's O'Brien. Hold on. O'Brien, I'm sick of doing your dirty work. You got news for me or not? Yeah, I, I mean, yes. I have news. Well, then what is it? I need you to do one last job. Were you listening to what I was just saying? I'm done with one this. One more job, then I'll meet you in person, show you what I got. Forget it. Her middle name. It was Irene, right? Sarah, Irene, Whitaker. It's on her admission form. One last job. One last job. I sent you the coordinates. O'Brien out. Hey. Hey. You headed somewhere in a hurry? Yeah. You remember that Nero bastard I told you about, yeah. O'Brien? Well, it looks like he's got some news for me, but I gotta do one last job for him first. Yeah. Okay. You should come with me. Yeah? Nah, I... Skizzle's got me on farm duty. Feeding the world one shitty weed at a time. Fuck Skizzle, I'll drop you off right afterward. When's the last time you saw a helicopter? Tell him he twisted my arm. Never gets old, <laughs> does it? Where are we headed? Over toward Malacqua Lake. You know where that is? Yeah, it's just north of the Rogue Tunnel off uh, Waldo Road. So what are we doing there? The Nero Chopper's gonna be on the ground doing whatever the hell it is that they do. O'Brien wants me to see what they're up to. So, Brian, he's, uh, he's what? Your shot caller? Handler? No! It's a boozer. You know why the hell we're out here. Just asking. Seems like he tells you to... Boozer! Jump, you ask how high. It's not how it is. How you holding up? Not bad. Uh, it's been worse, you know. I actually don't mind working the farm, pulling weeds and shit. Reminds me of when I was a kid. I used to go out to my uncle's farm out at uh, by Adrian on the Idaho border. I'd spend summers working the beet fields. <laughs> yeah, a little dirt bike I tooled around on. That's where I learned to ride. If you're not careful, I'm gonna start calling you Farmer Bill. When we get to that site, stay close. Whatever happens, don't let them see you. They can get a little trigger happy. Okay, okay, got it. Stay down, keep my mouth shut, don't get us killed. Hey, thanks for bringing me along, Deke. It's good to get out again. Even riding bitch, you know? <laughs> yeah. Okay, stay hey, close. You know the right down. behind you. Set up the perimeter. I want it tight. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Get this done. Jesus. Never thought I'd see one of those again. Here I know. I know, watch. The soldiers come out first, they secure the LZ. Then their boy genius, researcher, scientist, whatever the hell. He comes out, he looks around. Whatever science shit they're doing out here, how the hell would I know? Squad check. Really? I'm good. All good here. Okay. Okay, wait now. here. We're picking up scat samples. Shit. Yes. Freak shit. Yes. <laughs> so, we're out here in the middle of nowhere. So, you can pick up freak shit. 
precisely. <laughs> okay. Enough said. Field note 2102. After analysis of scat samples from zones 2, 3, and 4B, there is clear evidence of Claytonia perfoliata. What's that? Commonly known as miner's lettuce. Please don't interrupt. As well as manicious berries from Juniperus communis. So, why do we care? Why do we care? Because it means the freaks are eating more than just us and each other. They're eating berries, plants, grass, needles, basically anything a deer would eat. They're omnivores, just like us, but with stomachs that can digest a much wider range of cellulose. Yeah, okay. And what? It means they're not gonna starve when they run out of us to eat. The freaks aren't going away anytime soon. Shit, that's bad. Yeah, that's bad. I'm done here. Okay. Uh, head back to the bike. You catch any of that over my radio? That's pretty fucked up. Good taxpayer money and they're out here collecting freaker shit. Yeah, I told you. Who knows what they're doing or why? Oh, they gotta have a base around here somewhere, right? You try following them? Yeah, but they always disappear over the mountains heading south. And with the highway choked off, I can never get close. Sons of bitches. Seems like they got a lot to answer for. Yeah. Where are we headed now? It's a good question. O'Brien, are you there? Come in, O'Brien. I'm here. Finished? Yeah, it's done. Where am I meeting you? I wasn't expecting you so soon. I'm sending you the coordinates now, but it might take a few minutes to get there. O'Brien out. Jesus, what the hell does he think I've been doing out here? Hey, you're right about one thing. He does sound like an asshole. You wait here. I don't want him getting skittish because I brought someone along. Yeah, I'll keep an eye on the bike. I've seen enough Nero assholes for one day. Okay, I'll be back. O'Brien said he had news. He knew her middle name. Irene. She can't be alive. But he's alive. Why not her, huh? There he is. Yo. Shit. Gotta stop doing that. What you got? Alright, look. I'm gonna lay it out for you, but it's not good news. I finally found a guy who was willing to do some digging through some files that, we, that they used to keep while they still kept records. Okay, no problem. Anyway, Sarah Whitaker, your wife, was admitted to the Camp Mash unit on the South Flats outside of Silver Lake. Uh, according to the records, she was in surgery for six hours and then was moved okay, to... So she survived. The stab wound, she survived. Yeah, yeah. According to the records, she made a full recovery. And then she was moved to another camp on the outskirts okay, of Tumult. Okay, so, so she could still be alive. Even after all this time, she could still be alive, you're saying? No. What do you mean, no? It was overrun. Everything was overrun. There were no survivors. You survived. They survived. Look, 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 look. There was nothing that would have protected that camp, OK? Highway 97 w w is an artery. Infected. Freaks poured up from L.A., from the Bay Area, from Sacramento. There were thousands and thousands and thousands of them. There was, there was nothing we could do. I get it. So you bugged out. Who did you bring with you? Uh, Nero personnel, some feds, people with clearance. Nero personnel, the soldiers, the guys with the guns, the guys who should have been protecting no, no, the civilians. There's nothing that you can do against a horde. Oh, They're no, too strong. I know all They're about hordes. Oh, they know that there was nothing that we could do. Oh, you know what you could have done? You could have brought a few of them with you. You could have saved a few lives. There was no hope, there was no time, there was no room, okay? We had already turned on each other by the time the hordes arrived. No, I get it. Look, I'm sorry about your wife. I'm sorry about all of this. But you gotta understand. If you hadn't sent her with me that night, she would have been dead the next morning. You did the right thing. <laughs> <laughs> 
you know, if you had decided to stay, the only thing that would have happened is you'd be dead right alongside her. Don't you think I know that? <laughs> O'Brien. Thank you for saving her life that night. So you're sorry. Is that it, O'Brien? You're sorry? Oh, damn it. All things a waste of my goddamn time. Oh, what the hell? Boozer? Boozer? Oh, God damn it, Booze, man. Where the hell did you go? Ah, shit. Ah, right. Booze, man, where the hell did you go? Book tracks. It's gotta be his. Where? Ah, uh, this way. Deacon St. John. Ah, uh, yeah. Ricky, I'm here. What's up? Schizo's been asking for you. Said Boozer never showed up for his work duty. I, I was worried. No, look, we're fine. We just had some stuff that we needed to get done. Tell Schizo we'll be back in an hour. Okay. Hey, I'm almost ready to head back out there and fix that transformer. You still in? Uh, yeah. Yeah, just, uh, great. Let me know when. I can feel that hot water now. I'm gonna let that shower run forever. Yeah, okay. Uh, that's, that it sounds great. Listen, uh, Ricky, I, I gotta go, all right? Deacon out. Deke, over here! Oh, Jesus, Boozer, what the hell? I figured I'd do a little shopping while we were out, and I ran into a pack of rippers hunting dogs. Oh, easy, fella. He's not infected. You are he's, shit. he's just a dog. They're hunting down and killing healthy dogs. No, just, no, we can't. God. We can't leave him here, Deke. Uh, we just, we can't. We right, can't do right. it here. Here, let me, uh, let me do it. Really? You, you can. Okay, boy. Okay, you see, it's okay. All right, just. Oh, this. Jesus, Deke. Sounds disappointed. Well, I just, I hate those sons of bitches, you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, let's uh, let's get the hell out of here. So what the hell happened back there? You seem sort of, I don't know, like uh, like you lost it. Huh? I don't know. I guess I just, I needed some payback for this shit. But uh, there's never gonna be enough payback, is there? You know. If you hadn't made this shit for me, you know, my arm, I mean, I don't know where I'd be. I mean, I guess I'd... Oh, hell. You know. 
Are you gonna be okay? Yeah, not like I got a choice. Not like any of us do, right? Yeah, okay, come on. Hey, how'd it go? Oh, uh, what go? You know, goddamn well, your guy in the spacesuit, what'd he say? Ah, oh, it doesn't matter. Hey, come on, goddammit. <sighs> Boozer, you really don't want to be doing that right now. Oh, yeah? You think I need more than this to take down your scrawny little ass? Come on, what'd he say? Drop it. Seriously, what happened to Sarah? Huh? Where's your old lady? Where's your old lady? Huh? Stay down, brother. Had enough? Where's your old lady, Deke? She's dead, Boozer. Sarah's dead. Yeah, and she's been dead a long time. So don't you think that you've mourned her long enough? You have a hell of a left hook, asshole. Oh. Yeah, it's the only move I got. <laughs> Come on, man. I gotta get my sorry ass back to work. Camping gonna feed itself. It's the only move I got. Still, I tagged your ass with it three times in a row. Oh, fucking shameful. <laughs> Where are we headed? Back to camp. No, no. I still gotta work a shift. Give me a ride up there. It's it's just north of Sherman's camp. Okay. So, she died that night. And there was nothing you or anyone could have done about it. I should have been there. And what good would that have done? Just drop it, it's done. Schizo, you there? Lost Lake Camp, Schizo. Yeah, yeah, what's up? We just had a run-in with... Hey, where the hell did you bro? We skipped work duty today. What the hell, man? Would you, sh just sh shut up and listen to me. I was giving him a ride to the work site, and we were attacked by rippers. Ah, oh, Jesus. Where? Outside of Rogue Camp. You gotta tell Iron Mike. Carlos is coming, and he is not going to stop. What do you think I've been telling him? For months? Yeah, I'll let him know. We're heading toward Tumalo now. Boozer will be at the site in a few minutes. Well, that's great, because he owes the camp another half shift for the work he's missed. Shut up, Schizo. Hey, Deke. Uh, road camp is kind of in the opposite direction of Tumalo, isn't it? We took the scenic route. Out. Asshole. Goddamn Schizo. Come on, you guys. Come on, keep working. Keep at it. We don't work, we don't eat. Right already. That's it. Hey. Thanks for the ride. We all start. Here you go. Say, John, to Lost Lake Camp. Come back. Deke, I hear you. Mike. Good. Look. Boozer and I, uh, we just had a run-in with Rippers. They, uh... Rippers? God damn it, you boys crossed the Iron Ridge! Dick, I told you! Just listen. No, Mike. They were here, in Rogue Camp. Rogue Camp? There were Rippers in Rogue Camp? You sure it was Rippers? Jesus, Mike, yeah. They're kind of hard to miss, you know, with the scars and acting crazy, killing anything that moves. All right, just calm down. We got a parlay with Carlos. He's gives us heading over to Iron Butte tomorrow. We'll find out what the hell is going on, and then we'll... You're sending Schizo to parlay with Carlos. Jesus, Mike. Don't tell me how to run my camp, Deke. Like I said, my treaty is gonna hold Lost Lake out. Now, whatever you say, Mike. Whatever you say, Schizo's right. You're gonna get everyone killed. This is Tucker. Stop by. I've got work for you. Tuck, hey. Okay. I'll see if I can make time deacon out. Never mind. Just deacon. 